Roman merchant ships. The main ships in the Roman world were merchant ships and war ships. Merchant ships were sometimes called cargo ships or trading vessels and could be as long as 300 feet and held 300 passengers. Some had 20 to 30 oarsmen with long oars on each side of the ship, big sails, rudders, anchors, and ropes. The best time for travel was the summer months, yet a journey from Israel to Rome could take 100 days, which sometimes put the crew in danger. The Bible mentions that Paul traveled by ship 13 times on his missionary journeys, and it also mention, mentions his shipwreck on his way to Rome and the 276 passengers on board. The Jewish historian Josephus was also involved in a shipwreck on his way to Rome, and there were 600 people on board his ship. Paul spent several years in Ephesus, one of the most famous ports and trade centers in the Roman Empire, and its temple was one of the seven wonders of the world. In the book of Ephesians, Paul said that the believers in Jesus were sealed with the Holy Spirit. Paul was using the imagery of a merchant marking his packages with a seal of ownership. When the ship arrived, the merchant could claim what was his. The seal was also used as a guarantee of payment. Paul also said in Ephesians that believers in Jesus had formerly walked according to the course of this world. The course was like a flag on a ship that marked the direction the wind was blowing. 